If you let your children play an online video game through Xbox, PlayStation, or the computer, they might be exposed to more than you think. Matthew Kinney loves to play online video games with his sons. What he doesn't love, what his kids are hearing from the other players. Language that would make a sailor blush. Not surprising, says Kevin Roberts, author of the book Cyber Junkie. Considering the average gamer is 37 years old. He says when your child takes the game online and players start interacting, all content ratings go out the window. Incredible levels of profanity, racial epithets, homosexually oriented epithets. And we're talking eight, nine, 10, 11 year old kids who are getting exposed to this regularly. Internet safety expert Pari Aftab says this inappropriate language in online gaming is rampant. They may be trash talking, they may be calling you names, they may steal their passwords, or a lot of them may gang up on one online, not because it's a good strategic win, but to hurt the other person. Game companies attempt to combat these issues with on-box warnings, parental controls, and special task squads, but parental involvement is still key. Play the games. Talk to your kids about the games. Get involved in it. Also, ask your child to unplug the headphones and turn up the speakers so you can hear exactly what's being said, and teach them to take an active role against bullies. Tell them to block the person or the message, and then they need to come and tell you. Tell a trusted adult. As for Matthew, he believes his proactive parenting allows the kids to enjoy the games while staying safe. You teach them the best you can, and there have been times where they'll disconnect. It's like it just gets too bad and they know better. Microsoft says protecting their customers has always been a top priority, and they've invested significant resources to monitor violations. On your side, Courtney Garish, today's TMJ4.